Hi there, folks. This is Levi Kuhn at Kuhn Truck and RV, your Class B and B-plus RV specialists. Please check out our website, www.truckandrv.com. That's truckandrv.com to view all of our inventory. We do not put any pricing on YouTube, but all of our prices are listed on our website. So if you have any price inquiries, please jump over to our website. I will also put a direct link to this particular RV in the description below. We are a full service dealer. We do offer warranty as well as financing packages. If you have any questions on those, please call my brother Luke in our office at 419-899-2020. For sale today, we have a 2005 Lexington. All right, everybody, it's time for the inside portion of today's video tour. I will start towards the front here, make my way towards the back, then I will come back towards the rear to try to give you a few different angles so you can get a feel of what it's like to be inside this RV. On the passenger side, we have a dinette that goes down into a bed, which will sleep two people. On the driver's side, we have the jackknife sofa, which will also turn down into a bed and sleep two people as well for a total sleeping capacity of four people. This one has oak cabinetry all the way throughout. The thermostat for the furnace, propane furnace, is on the wall there. This one is equipped with a rooftop air conditioner. The controls for the air conditioner are directly on the unit there. All of our units go through a pretty thorough inspection and reconditioning process. I have four guys in our shop. Two of them are fixers, fix it uppers, and two of them are uh, cleaning guys. All the systems are tested and inspected to make sure that they're working properly. Uh, everything inside and outside is cleaned very thoroughly. In the back corner of the slide out, we have a wardrobe. Opposite that, that back to the passenger side, uh, we have another wardrobe in the closet there, along with the refrigerator. Some people also use this as a storage for food, a pantry. Uh, they'll take some modular shelving, put that in there, and also use that for a pantry sometimes as well. Coming back to the rear of the unit, this is a rear side entry. Door is on the back passenger corner. Range hood. Three burner cooktop, microwave and convection oven, CO2 detector, battery disconnect switch. I believe that one's an access panel so you can get to the, some of the water lines for winterizing. Fuse panel, two basin kitchen sink. We got a control panel on the wall here. This one here will show you how much is in each one of your tanks, propane, your battery gauge. Fresh water, black water, and gray water. Remote start switch for the Onan 4K generator. Hot water heater switch. Hot water is propane. Water pump, Arctic package. The Arctic package is a little extra insulation underneath and then they also put heated pads on the holding tanks. Uh, living room light, kitchen light. Uh, this one's an outside light. And then our slide out switch. Coming into the bathroom here, decent sized bathroom, decent room to move around, bathroom sink, got a medicine cabinet above that on the wall, vent in the ceiling with a fan to exhaust the steam and 
stinky fumes. Good size stand up shower. Also has the overhead skylight, which gives you a little extra headroom if you were a taller person. What do you call a cow that does not give any milk? A milk dud. Uh -huh. um, okay, back to all seriousness. Refrigerator and freezer. Good size here. Uh, this will run on propane gas or 110 electricity. We've got vinyl floor back here in the entry, entryway, uh, kitchen and bathroom. This one here is set up more as a pantry tile style storage with the slide out shelving racks. Really nice clean unit. Uh, the interior is very clean carpet as you can see doesn't really look uh, stained but it definitely has some some fading in the carpet from the age ceiling uh, very clean dinette cushions couch cushions front seats all in really good shape woodworking all shines nicely There's no damages anywhere uh, exterior shined up very nicely still has a pretty good shine to it front we've got leather seats cd player power windows locks tilt cruise uh, pretty well loaded up up front this one sits on a ford e450 chassis with the triton v10 gasoline engine if you have any questions on this one give us a call at coon truck and rv the best little rv dealer around Real quick here, I'm gonna run around the outside of this unit, give you a description of where the storage compartments are located. Down bottom here, we've got the propane tank. Behind that, we've got a pretty large storage compartment here. Silver one is the furnace vent, refrigerator vent, We've got some outlets here for plugging in some outside speakers if you wanted to, uh, cooktop, anything, you name it. Hot water heater access, uh, smaller storage compartment down low. Coming around to the rear, got your spare mounted on the back, ladder on the back to climb up to check out the roof. Got the tow package and also the seven way trailer wiring harness rear driver's corner we've got the storage compartment for the shore power cord down on the bottom uh, dump station dump your black and gray water tanks fuel tank storage compartment for a sewer hose outside shower and telephone and cable hookup. Underneath the slide on the driver's side, we have the coach batteries and then the Onan 4K gasoline generator. And last but not least, we have the water hookups, fresh water hookups.